2019 AOCS fellow Richard Rick D. Ashby is a senior research scientist in the Biobased and Other Animal Co-Products Research Unit for the United States Department of Agriculture's Agricultural Research Service at the Eastern Regional Research Center in Windmore, Pennsylvania. Dr. Ashby is author or co-author of over 250 publications and presentations about biobased production, characterization, property manipulation, and the application of microbial polymers and surfactants. He is a recognized expert in the use of various fermentation techniques for the synthesis of glycolipids and bacterial polyesters. After obtaining his doctorate from Louisiana State University in 1994, he worked as a postdoctoral fellow in the Department of Chemistry at the University of Massachusetts Lowell under Richard A. Gross studying molecular weight control of PHA biopolymers using polyethylene glycol. He joined ARS in 1996, where his focus was on the use of animal fats and vegetable oils as renewable feedstocks for PHA production. As the biodiesel industry gained traction, his research focus shifted to the use of crude glycerol and other cheap renewable materials as feedstocks for microbial growth and product synthesis. His work with crude glycerol resulted in his research group being awarded the 2008 Glycerin Innovation Award bestowed by AOCS. Currently, he is continuing his research focus on the use of fermentation to economically produce unique microbial products designed for widespread industrial application. Congratulations, Dr. Richard Ashby, 2019 AOCS Fellow. 2019 AOCS Fellow Dr. William Craig Birdwell is a research chemist at the Food Composition and Methods Development Laboratory in the Beltsville Human Nutrition Research Center, which is a part of the United States Department of Agriculture's Agricultural Research Service. Dr. Birdwell received his undergraduate and graduate degrees from the University of Louisville, writing his dissertation on identification of the unknown phospholipid in the human eye lens and quantification of fluorophones in normal and cataractous lenses. Dr. Birdwell took a position at the USDA's National Center for Agricultural Utilization Research to work on analysis of triacyl glycerols using high-performance liquid chromatography with atmospheric pressure chemical ionization mass spectroscopy. Then, Dr. Birdwell took a position at Florida Atlantic University, where he routinely employed dual mass spectrometers in parallel using both APCI mass spectroscopy and electrospray ionization mass spectroscopy. He rejoined ARS in 2005 and took on quantification of vitamin D and triacylglycerols. Recently, Dr. Birdwell has been analyzing fat-soluble vitamins and triacylglycerols using triple and quadruple parallel mass spectrometry approaches, combining three or four mass spectrometers employing complementary ionization methods. Dr. Birdwell has published more than 60 peer review articles and 10 book chapters, and has been editor, co-editor of three AOCS press books. He is on the editorial advisory board of Lipids, is the Lipidomics Associate Editor for the Lipid Library and maintains numerous websites. Dr. Birdwell received the 2012 Herbert J. Dutton Award from the AOCS Analytical Division and presented the 2013 Society of Chemical Industry Julius Lekowicz Award Lecture. Congratulations, Dr. William Craig Birdwell, 2019 AOCS Fellow. 2019 AOCS Fellow Dr. Mila P. Ojia Evangelista holds the distinction of being the seventh woman to ever be named an AOCS Fellow. Dr. Ojia Evangelista was born and raised in the Philippines, where she received her Bachelor of Science cum laude in Food Technology and Master of Science in Food Science from the University of the Philippines at Los Baños. She earned her doctorate in Food Technology from Iowa State University. She is presently a research chemist at the United States Department of Agriculture's Agricultural Research Service National Center for Agricultural Utilization Research in Peoria, Illinois. Her research career has focused on value-added products from the processing of soybeans, corn, and alternative oilseed crops. Her recognitions include the 2018 Iowa State University Food Science and Human Nutrition Alumni Impact Award, 2018 College Distinguished Alumnus Award from the University of the Philippines at Los Baños, 
AOCS ADM Best Paper Award in Protein and Co-Products four times, and the 2007 Federal Laboratory Consortium FLC Award for Excellence in Technology Transfer. Within AOCS, her primary professional society, she has been a long-serving associate editor for the Journal of the American Oil Chemists Society and elected to various leadership positions, including secretary, treasurer, vice chair, and chair of the protein division and member at large of the AOCS governing board. She served as invited guest editor of the peer-reviewed special issue on bio-based adhesives for the Journal of Adhesion Science and Technology in 2013 and the special issue on alternative proteins for the Journal of the American Oil Chemist Society in 2018. She has mentored a postdoctoral research associate and two PhD candidates and is actively involved in many student outreach programs for STEM activities for local students and educators. Congratulations Dr. Mila P. Ojia Evangelista 2019 AOCS Fellow. 2019 AOCS Fellow Eric J. Murphy earned a BA in History and Biology from Hastings College and a doctorate in Biochemistry from The Ohio State University, where he studied brain lipid biochemistry with Lloyd Horrocks. He was an assistant research scientist at Texas A&M University, where he studied the role of cytosolic lipid binding proteins with Fred Schroeder. He served as a senior National Research Council Fellow at the National Institutes of Health and focused on the effect of neurodegenerative disease on brain lipid metabolism with Stanley Rappaport. In 2000, he joined the University of North Dakota as an assistant professor. At UND, he brought together kinetic modeling of lipid metabolism in vivo, coupled with his expertise in cytosolic lipid binding proteins to study the role that these and other proteins have in brain lipid metabolism. He continues to work in the broad area of omega-3 fatty acid metabolism to distinguish the metabolic differences between plant-derived and marine-derived omega-3 dietary sources. In 1999, he received the Jordi Folk P Award for his work in brain lipid neurochemistry. In 2006, he became the editor-in-chief of Lipids. In 2005, he became chief strategy officer of Agrogen LLC, a plant science company focused on using Camelina sativa as a platform for biopharmaceutical and bioactive fatty acid production for use in humans and in animal feeds. In 2015, he and his sons founded CrampAid LLC, a company that produces anti-cramping formulations for use across a broad consumer base. And from 2014 to 2016, he served on the North Dakota State Board of Higher Education. Congratulations, Eric J. Murphy, 2019 AOCS Fellow.